let's go back to this idea of division having two distinct interpretations, and both of them are going to be useful. So again, the idea is that a division like A divided by B, I can view this as a partitive question. I'm going to take A and I'm going to divide it, break it into B equal parts, and my goal is to find out how big each part is. Or I could view it as a quotative division. I'm going to take A and break it into parts of size B, and I want to find out how many parts there are. And the tape diagram can be used to model both divisions. So for example, let's take uh, 24 divided by 4. We'll show them partitively and quotatively using a tape diagram. So we'll start with our partitive division. It's the more natural way to read the division, if not to actually perform it. Uh, so with partitive division, I'm going to take a tape of that represents 24, and I'm going to break it into four equal pieces. So there's my tape representing 24. I'll break it into four equal parts. And my question is how big each part is going to be. Well, if this is 24, I want all of these parts to have the same size, and maybe I don't know how big those parts are, so maybe I'll take a guess. Suppose each part is five. Well, that's all of them are going to be five, and well, that's not quite enough. That's 10, 20, so I am still not quite at 24 yet, so I've got to increase the size of those parts a little bit. So I'll increase the size by one more, so that's 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. This is everything, and so each of these parts is a five and a one, so each of those parts represents a six. And so there's my partitive division. On the other hand, if I want to form the quotative division, I'm going to divide 24 into parts of size 4, which is the quota. So I'll have my figure representing 24, and I'll mark off parts of size 4. So there's a part, there's another, there's another, there's another. Let's see what I have so far. I have 4, 8, 12, 16. I have a couple more parts I could make. That's 20, and that last one is going to be 4, and the quotient is going to be the number of parts. So here, my parts are size 4, and there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 of them, and there's my quotient.